I'm from Chelsea Fan TV. I'm outside the Vitality Stadium in Bournemouth uh, with Matt, my friend Matt. Listen, I mean, look, you look trendy today. I'll give you that. You uh, you did Absolutely. not prepare for the cold. I, yeah, like, I mean, I've got cold. four layers on. I'll be honest, I thought it was going to be a little bit colder than I, this. I know, because every time we come here, we, st we still never lose, so that's just a thing. We ain't sure, lost here. Sure. Three years on the bounce? Yeah, three years on the bounce, we ain't lost here. Second of all, I came here for a night out, you came here for a warm, comfy bed. Totally <laughs> <other way, so. laughs> different vibes, so. No, yeah. it's true. I mean, listen, Matt, what did you think about what you saw? Because we started off first, very shaky. Uh, but do you know what it is? It's not that we were well bad in the first half. We were good defensively. We weren't too bad. Mate, that passing was so bad in the first half. You know what? And as well, I was even going to be screaming, like a bit of a screaming for an Enzo, because we had Viega. Mate, he was really good with the tackling, really good with the tackling. But the passing was sloppy in the Cossay. Like, it's other things I think they played well as all right. I just think the passing was too sloppy in the first half. Nothing was getting created. Yeah. Anti Taylor. I hate bringing up the ref, but that geezer is an absolute mong, mate. He's an absolute mong. Like, how many, I think, 14 yellow cards are you given out, mate, this game? And half them for absolute nothing. Like, just giving out anything for anything, mate. I, they, I don't know how they ain't stripped them and chucked him down to the National League, mate. He's an absolute disgrace of the Premier League. Do you, know, do you, do you think that he was at least consistent, even if yeah, they yeah, were yeah, consistently yeah, bad? Yeah, yeah, he's consistently shit every single game. It's why every single team moan about having him. And we've, uh, it's just the second game this season with him or third. A few, haven't they? Yeah, like second, second game, yeah. Game. We're like, yeah, two and four, like fifth, like six, one half a dozen of the other much. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, it was like it's jarring. Anthony Taylor being like, you know what? I'm going to make this game all about me, like he always does. But somehow, he's going home fuming tonight, isn't he? That we managed to bug that in the end. He's fuming, even at the very end. How much extra time? You even blagged another minute at the end of that as well, thinking, yeah, come on, Bournemouth equalise. Honestly, the only reason why he probably actually managed to not give it an extra five minutes extra time is because his team, Man United, actually won for once today. It's the only reason why fucking he was slightly a bit more happier, I think, because yeah. normally the gig's an absolute melon, mate. Well, I mean, we we said the same things. I'm just going on to players now about Sanchez. A lot of people don't like this guy. Sanchez, well, and he, he he did it do today. You know, do you know what? It, do you know what he done well today? When he had to boot the ball out, he booted the ball out. When he had to pass it, he had to pass it. And when he had to make a save, when he had to save a penalty, Sanchez, other than you could argue Cucurella, look, Enzo Marasca, them half time, them subs were spot on. He see the sassy struggling, not fuck. He sticks tossing on for him. He takes off Jackson, who, who I think is consistently the same, like good in the build up, but quite lacks the finish at the end. But like I said, I still rate Jackson very, very highly. Like, do you know what I mean? But I think for today, taking him off and putting Nkuku on, and that old Jaden Sancho, mate, Eric, Eric Den Hag's fucking absolutely having a cry about this tonight. Yeah, he was good today. Sancho. You think Sancho's going to be a starter for us in the future? I don't know. Like, I think you've got a lot of depth yeah, in those yeah, positions. Yeah, I mean, wingers, like, you could play anyone, but I'd, I'd like to see maybe Nkuku in the 10, Palmer down the right again. Like I said, like I, said, I don't, like, we have a very, very good bunch of players in that team. And they're all good. There's a quality written everywhere and every and the only thing is now is getting everyone to link in to know where everyone is at the right time to get a bit more forward like fuck all the passing backwards and like there was a few times today we should have just passed forward so many times San Sancho was open on that right left hand side so much today mm. like I thought and it was and like he was, especially, he was taking yeah, people yeah, on though mate he was going for it he was good mate like I said like I didn't think we were that bad in the first half I just thought we lacked that quality in the past to really get the mm. ball anywhere other than that mate fucking I thought we were sweet I'm happy mate I'm happy it came here three points where we're in the table now surely sixth or seventh now uh, yeah, Charlie where are we in yeah, the table we were, 11, we were 11th yesterday we're top, guys. We'll probably be top half Top, yeah. hey, top half, mate. <laughs> no, but I mean, I, 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 we're seventh. Seventh. All right. Do we celebrate seventh? Yeah, maybe not. Um, but yeah, I mean, listen. There's Matt's thoughts there. I mean, do you have anything you want to round this out with, Matt? Because, because I'll be honest. I, I, Jacob made a great point. Um, I don't, I don't know if it's a point, but he he made a statement that kind of it's very very true. We've we've been through the mills. And we've had some really tough ones. And to come out 
And I don't want to say it was stress-free, because it wasn't. We obviously could see the penalty, we could have easily dropped points, but it's as comfortable as we've seen for quite some time. Getting a clean sheet away from home as well, I mean, we've really struggled for it's that. It's not the size of the dog, it's the size of the fight in the dog, mate. And we are fucking woofing ourselves to the fucking <laughs> Premier League title, mate. Woof. <laughs> Give it one of them, mate. No, I ain't giving it another one for you. No, that's that's the last of it. Yeah, mate, I'm fucking buzzing, mate. No, I'm, I'm, mate, I'm hoping we'll get something good, mate. I love it, mate. Thank you so much. Enjoy the night out. Yeah, no, we'll do straight up. <laughs>